Hey guys, it's your girl Tia. So I just got home from seeing a screening for Blair Witch. And I have to say, to my surprise, that movie was actually pretty damn good. Now, I did see the first one that came out in 99. But for the life of me, I cannot remember what the hell happened. I mean, I have bits and pieces in my head. But to tell you it from beginning to end, I can't remember. And I've probably seen it only once or twice. So I'm actually happy about that because I went in seeing the screening with an open mind. No prejudgments. So that's actually a good thing to me. Um, but basically the movie is, is a sequel to the first one. And this is the little brother that's actually grown now. Because in the first one that was his sister who um, disappeared. So he um, stumbled across this video on YouTube. And it was footage of the shit that went down almost 20 years ago. So him and his friends uh, find the person who put up the video and they tag along and they go to where they last seen or found their, I guess his sisters because they found all of the, the cameras and equipment in the woods but they didn't find their bodies so that's where they went so when they get there that's when shit gets real like, I think the first one or two days I mean the first day it's okay the second day it was the third day yeah, so, uh, but I don't want to spoil anything, but I do want to say, like, if, if you guys seen the first one, that um, everybody died in the order I thought they were going to, almost, I missed it by two, 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 I was like, shit, okay, cool, which is fine, you know what I mean, I, I'm still proud of myself, but, um, and, uh, like I said, I hope I didn't spoil it, but I mean, if you've seen the first one, n nobody lives. <laughs> so, expect that and then some. Uh, but the movie was definitely, um, definitely scary. I wouldn't say that it was better than The Conjuring 1 and 2, because both of them took my soul. <laughs> this one, it actually let me keep it. I just screamed a little bit more, that's all. Um, but, uh. There's no blood and gore in here, so I mean, if you guys are parents and you have children, um, there's no cutting off heads and limbs and none of that shit. Um, it does have some eerie parts in there that makes your fucking skin crawl, like oh my god. But other than that, everything is good. So if they're 13 and up, it should be fine. But um, overall, I mean, I usually number it based on a whole bunch of things, but overall the movie was an 8. I mean, the scare, the plot, the story, I mean, everything, like, everything built built up, and, like, the fear was here all the way until the end. Like, shit is so real. I loved it. So I definitely recommend you guys to go see it. This, this was a screening, so you guys won't be able to see it until Thursday or Friday night, depending on where you're located. So um, if you are subscribed to my channel, please come back and let me know what you think after you see it. So I hope to hear from you guys soon, and I'll see you guys in my next review. This is...